Hi Virgos, I'm Ace Empress. I'm here to do a love energy check reading for you guys. And these are your five cards that represent the present energy. What is going on for Virgos in their love life right now? I feel like some of you are singles. Like 60% of you watching this are singles. I feel like you're hoping for somebody to come in your life. And you're like, I don't even have a love life when I'm watching this reading. Let me tell you something. You're going to meet somebody. Either in a party or this is somebody in your friend circle. I know it's quarantine time so we will not go to party. But you might have met this person in the past. In some kind of a party or meeting, meet up situation. The vision that you have in your mind about how your love life should be is you want commitment because Virgos are like that, right? Virgos are very commit commitment types. Virgos are, believe in long-term commitments. When they commit to something, they believe in it and they they take it to the end. They don't leave situations, people, projects in between. Then we have the lovers in the center of the reading. You're hoping for a soulmate to come in your life and the universe is saying just wait. This is number six and I think Virgos are also number six, six in the zodiac signs. You're hoping for a sweet individual to come in your life who's lovely, who's caring, who's nurturing. You may be good with animals and you want someone who is good with animals too so that you can have pets. So I asked what kind of person is coming in your life we have three cards so this is a person who might be shorter than you for some of you this is a person who has their money you know they know how to manage money money management skills they have it this is somebody who likes to speak the truth all the time this is somebody who does not speak much you know they like to say, when they speak they speak the truth but they don't like to speak much. It's not like you go to a party and they're like chattering. And they're the loudest person on in the whole party scene. No. This is somebody who is like elegant and poised and sitting. You know, um, maybe this person is sitting alone. This person believes in positivity. So they like to be positive all the time. What is the universe's advice? This person who's coming in your life would also appreciate if you speak the truth all the time. The universe is saying, I know you have been depressed. I know you have been lonely. This is your card, Virgo. I know you have been alone. I know you have been looking at the moon and praying for the one to come in your life. You have been patient. I'm sending this person towards you is what universe is saying. When universe is saying good things come to those who wait. What else does the universe want to say? Again, the universe is saying wait. The... You know the mission to send you a soulmate has already begun but it's kind of like 20 or 30 percent done it's not 100 percent yet so so when is this person coming towards you coming soon but it will take time but it may take uh, 20 21 
maybe the lockdown will open and you'll go to a party and then you will meet someone let me see something from the rider white it's a long cruciating wait but there's hope this is also number six number six might be important to you now it has come in this reading so many times we also have six of cups see i said wait for at least one year one year The true love, eternal love, unconditional love is coming towards you finally. This person, you might be really emotional and this person is opposite. This person is really logical, practical. They think from the head and you think from the heart. You're emotional and this person is like not emotional. <laughs> Mm, let me pull something from this. Let's see. Your person could be having family issues and they are healing those right now. And the universe doesn't want you to be a part of those issues. So they are clearing up those issues. They are working with your person. Angels, spirit guides, God, whatever you believe in, are working with your person so that these issues do not become your issues. <clears throat> You're going to have heart to heart conversations with your person and this is going to help you a lot. Because you kind of, may, maybe you guys have different love languages. There are five kind of love languages. Maybe if you don't know that, go search on Google. You might have different love language. As I'm saying, one might be interested in, one might be like talk, talk, talk. Another person might be like quiet. For some of you, your person works in a hospital, a clinic, I don't know. Let go of control issues and allow the situation to unfold naturally. The universe is saying, let you know, you, you might be saying that it's taking so much time. Let it take its own sweet time. Because good things come to those who wait. If you want good fruit, you gotta wait. Religious factors. You have to wait, I mean you are made to wait by the universe because universe is sorting out some things for you. Universe is clearing up some things for you. So before you come together and be in union, they, it will take time. But it will be worth the wait. This is what I see for you guys and I hope you like this reading and gave you clarity. If it did, please like, share, subscribe, comment and um, also if you want to book a personal reading, DM me on Instagram. The link is down below in the description box. Thank you for watching.